Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back once again with the Orion Motor Tech 55 watt laser cutter. A user asked me how big it is. I got a tape measure, so let's get cracking. All right, friends. So, first things first, the actual width of it is 45 inches. I've got it on a jinky stand because I'm moving it about my room. But if you measured from the casters, it is 24 inches at the front. In the back, you'll find it is 25 inches because it does slope down like this. And then it will stick out a minimum of 30 inches. But you also need to remember that you're going to need access to this. So when it opens up, so when we lay that down, you need at least 15 inches so that you can get inside the machine to check your milliamps. And if anything ever went wrong, that's how you'd have to get access to it. Of course, you also need to plan for your vent and the hoses and where you're going to store either your chiller or your bucket with the water that you use with the little aquarium pump. Lastly, on this side, you do have access as well. There's less to get at over here, but you still don't want to lock yourself into a corner where you can't get at it. Alrighty, friends, so once again, 45 inches this way, plus 15 inches on each side. That's 70 inches you should plan for that way. And then I would plan for having at least a foot behind it so you're at 42 inches forward. Real quickly, let's check the height when you go vertically. It would be about 45 inches. Alrighty, friends, so there it is, short and sweet. Those are your dimensions if you're looking at the Orion Motor Tech 55 watt laser. Friends, if you enjoyed the video or found it useful, please give it a like. If you've got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.